these Tomasellis. They don't take crap from no one. Juggalos, anybody. Two tough Daniels stalking Vito Tomaselli with the chair. Wait a second. Sal Tomaselli pops out of nowhere with a clothesline, taking down two tough Tony. And the Iron Saints are looking good here in their PWU debut. And that setup was so wild in Coyote style. These guys are brilliant. Oh, man. But now, it looks like the Hatchet Boys have regained control of this matchup. Corporal Robinson is unceremoniously tossed. Vito Tomaselli back in the ring, and Corporal Robinson has got a steal chair. Hey, if the Tomasellis are victorious, victorious. Oh my goodness, oh! Big cross body splash into the guardrails. Sal Tomaselli is down, and it is not good. That was like a human drive-by right there. Right in front of us here, Corporal Robinson with the steel chair. He's setting him up for a pile drive right in front of us. Oh my! Oh. Oh. Steel chair on the floor. Vito may not give. Vito is not moving. Oh! Two tough Tony has just taken out the other Tomaselli brother. And, that, and Corp's trying to pin him. Wait, is there going to be a cover out here? I guess so. Two and a kick out after two. I guess the rule book is thrown out and we now have a false count anywhere match. This is how I like it. Make the people win. Oh, man. Oh, man. He's gonna kill me, Adam Zappel. Vito Tomaselli may have just lost his voice permanently after taking that chair shot straight to the and throat. And two tough Tony just wailed Sal in the uh, far corner from us of the guard rounds. Oh, no. Oh, Corporal Robinson now taken out by the same chair he used on Vito Tomaselli, who's gonna have some trouble breathing right now after taking that shot to the throat. Hey, karma can be a pain in the ass. You bring a chair in the, a match, you have to expect things to go wrong for you also. Well, here we go. Both Iron Saints are now in the ring. Father Hatcher boys are attempting to get into the ring. The Iron Saints, I, I, they definitely haven't dominated this match. They may made all the right decisions so far in this match. They're a thinking man's tag team. Oh, drop kicking Cooper Robinson to the outside. Two tough ponies left in there all alone as both men with two tough Tony of the Hatchet Boys. Yeah, the Thomas Ellies have isolated two tough Tony. A brilliant strategy. You oh. take out the former hardcore champion and you go on two tough Tony. An Iron Saints flash out. Oh! Cooper Robinson with the chair. Trying to come in, but reverse. Oh, no, stop. What, what is this? No way. He's got him in like a pen. He's setting up for like a pendulum type move. He, he can't quite get the bigger man. Oh my God. He's got. Oh! If that does not cause permanent spine damage, I don't know exactly what will. I think Too Tough Tony is dead. He better be too tough if he plans on getting up. The Tomasellis are making their claims here at PWU tonight. They have just shocked the entire Philadelphia area and the PWU audience here tonight. They have taken it to probably the two toughest individuals here in PW today, the Hatchet Boys. Two tough Tony. And Corporal Robinson is busted open. Oh, man. And, he's, and right now, Vito is driving his knuckles into the wound. He loves the blood on his fists. This is sick. It's not sick. You gotta send a funny fire with fire here. You gotta give it to the Iron State. Oh! Tumbling into Corporal Robinson. And now both Tomaselli's choking out with their boots, Corporal Robinson. And what a brilliant strategy. Hit him with a high impact move in the corner, then you cut his wind off with a foot to the throat. I cannot believe what I've just seen here. Corporal Robinson, our PWU hardcore champion, a man who has knocked out everybody who has stepped in his way for that PWU hardcore championship here at Pro Wrestling Unplugged. And he is on his knees, bloodied and beaten by these two young, brand new stars here in Pro Wrestling Unplugged. He's fighting back, but if the blood keeps seeping in his eyes, he's just throwing fists right now that he's hoping hit. Like oh, that. he break, he didn't break just the eye, he raked the actual cut. Oh man, Vito's up top. Oh, double axe handle smash into the open wound of Corporal Robinson. Hey, when, when he was punching, Corporal Robinson, 
excuse me, when Corporal Robinson was punching him in the face, Vito really didn't feel those, because Corp was wildly flinging, because the blood was in his eyes. And he's not, since he's been cut open, he has not been able to get a full advantage in this match for that simple reason. Two Tough Tony has made his way back onto the apron, now trying to rally the fans here behind them. Yeah, what good is the fan support if you're getting your ass kicked? These the fans don't have telekinesis powers that go into the wrestlers. When it's all here. about the heart and the passion. To know that an entire crowd, the most crazy crowd in the in all of wrestling and all sports, is right here in Philadelphia, and to have them behind you results in this. Corporal Robinson taking it to both Iron Saints single-handedly. Yeah, but he's trying to fight two men. Dope. Ducks the double clothesline, and two tough Cody is in. Shades of Ricky Morton by Corporal Robinson. Oh, taking down both Iron Saints, and two tough Cody is showing just how tough he and the Hatchet Boys are. The powers of the Juggalos are behind him right now. They're not a religion, but oh, brainbuster right there. To some people, the Juggalos are religion. I mean, I cover here two and a kick out after two, and this match lives on here at more than enough. Yes, but right now, the Hatcher boys have to slow it down. They have a man wounded on their team, so they have to slow this match down. And they're going for a double sling. Oh, no, they're just draping him over the top. Tony's going up top. A Corporal Robinson holds down. Corporal Robinson is holding down the fort right there. That's all he really can do right now. Oh, man! The back of the neck, right after a brain buster, was exposed right there. Could this be over? Oh! Vito breaks it up. It's going to Corporal Robinson. Tony is down. Sal is down. Corporal Robinson is down. But Vito is alive and well here at the new Alhambra Arena. Vito with a knee right to the jaw. And it looks like his mouth is wide open on that one, adding extra impact. Look at these shots. These are stiff shots from Vito Tomaselli. He's proven how iron tough the Iron Saints are. Oh! Drop kick to the face. Taking out Vito. Yeah, but too tough Tony right now. He's moving slow also. Oh, look at this. Wait a minute. I've seen this. I've seen the tapes online from the tour. Wait, what's, what's going on here, Dan? You, you're about to witness the most insane Why does this move. guy have a lighter? Oh, my God. I have not seen. This is not. No, what the? Oh, my God. He's a flaming fist. But Sal Tomaselli just put it out unceremoniously to the steel chair. Sal Tomaselli just played Smokey the Bear and took out two tough Tony's hand. Corporal Robinson now alone in the ring with Vito. Oh, here we go. Boot camp. Boot camp. This match could be over here. And a big fist of his own. Knock it out. Vito Tomaselli of the Iron Saints. What a cold cock by Corporal Robinson. And that is a fist, a, a move that has knocked out Pete Hunter, my boy. It has knocked out Aramis. It has knocked out Ian Rotten. It has knocked out everybody who stepped in the way of Corporal Robinson. And I think the Iron Saints have just been added to that list. You know, wait, wait, here comes. Wait, what is this? Brandon Tomaselli. That's the third Tomaselli. What the hell is he doing here? He sh he's showing support for his bros. He's not supposed to be in action until later on tonight when he takes on Ricochet and Chuck Taylor. Who said? This match has just been calling. Mike Keener is out. Cooper Robinson is out. Vito Tomaselli is out, but two tough Tony is up. Comes to the aid of his fallen hatchet boy. Yeah, but it's three against two, and that guy has a burnt fist. That's not going to stop two tough Tony. Oh, now all three Iron Saints have just taken out the hatchet boys. Look at this. Keenan down, two tough Tony down, Corporal Robinson is down. Talk about making an impact not in the PWU debut. Not since Joker has anyone made an impact in their debut. Look, listen to this crowd. They love him. It's not, it's, it, it, those are booze, Jake, they're booze. Yeah, but I love them, that's all that really matters. Tomaselli Brothers, Office 2008 for these guys. Well, Brandon Tomaselli won't be Ladies and gentlemen, tonight. in 14 minutes, 21 seconds, the referee has thrown the match out. No contest. It looks like the Hatchet Boys are the ones that have been thrown out. 
Brandon Tomaselli will be out here later on tonight to get on Ricochet and Chuck Taylor also making their PW debuts. All you can really do is give them a thumb up. I'm not giving them a thumbs up. That is pathetic. That is, that is...